Hi everyone, I'm Diana Palm. I'm so very sorry for the loss that you're experiencing. You are the exact reason why I created Reconnect and Grief Ease. Reconnect is a full service program where you work with me one-on-one -on -one for nine weeks. I've decided to make the same spiritual lessons more affordable for greater access to all of you who really need the help but may not have the time or finances to sign up for my program reconnect in my program griefies you will get the same nine spiritual lessons and nine specific assignments i know that many of you prefer working solo independently and at your own pace. And if so, this program will really help you. This will guide you in a way that you can take your own time and apply these lessons as they fit into your schedule. I find that the bereaved are a very underserved part of our population and that there aren't the proper spiritual resources to really help shift the energy of grief. It's not to say that you should not grieve after losing a loved one. It's more about how you grieve that matters. And as I've been shifting the consciousness around grief and helping people to get into alignment faster and really embrace their continued connection with their loved one, I find that other forms of grief therapy and support may be lacking the spiritual content and depth to help the bereaved actually move through their grief experience thoroughly. So it's not so much about speed as it is really looking at the proper things on a spiritual matter that help you elevate into a higher space. To better understand that, let's talk about frequency and vibration. Albert Einstein said, energy cannot be created or destroyed. It can only be changed from one form to another. Nikola Tesla said, if you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. So I'll share with you Dr. David Hawkins' emotional frequency chart so you understand a little bit more about how this relates to you and the grief you're experiencing right now. In this chart, you'll notice that down at the very bottom, there's shame, guilt, and then grief. Grief being the frequency of only 75. When you raise your frequency and vibration moving up the chart, you can eventually achieve of 500, which is the vibration of love, and even higher yet, the highest being 700, enlightenment. Now, I find that there's a very magical sweet spot between 500 and 700, which puts you in the vibrational frequency of the spirit world. Now, I know a lot of you may or may not believe in the spirit world. Some of you may not have a desire to connect with your loved one in the afterlife, but if you do, it will be essential to raise your frequency and vibration in to the higher range between 500 and 700. For those of you who have been in complicated grief, prolonged grief, or just feeling such a heaviness of grief in your life, your vibrational frequency is only resonating at 75. And I urge you to progress in your own healing because of the other types of things that can happen to you when your frequency is so low, when you're suffering in silence, when you're not being supported, and when you don't know the spiritual steps to follow in order to help heal your grief. Spirit showed me that nine weeks was an essential time frame to allow yourself to fully process and heal the energy of grief that you are experiencing in your life right now. We experience grief in the physical body, which creates aches and pains and different sicknesses. We experience grief mentally, emotionally, financially, and spiritually as well. I've worked with many people who are grieving the loss of their loved one and long to reconnect with them. They just hope that they will get a sign from their loved one that they are okay. That could include dream visits, signs and symbols from the afterlife, or other types of after-death communication. Sometimes people are so heavy in grief that they literally are blocking their own ability to have these beautiful and meaningful afterlife connections. Some of you may not desire to have these experiences, although raising your vibrational frequency will still assist you in many other areas of your life. For instance, when you don't heal your grief, you stay in a prolonged state of isolation where you may experience depression, anger, and feeling abandoned. This could lead to you feeling physically sick and re-experiencing your trauma or shock from the loss. You may have sleepless nights or inability to focus during the day. 
And this can have a direct impact on the way you show up in your work, the stability of your home life and your finances. So prolonged grief actually keeps you in a very low frequency that can cause harm to many areas of your life. And this is why I think it's so very important for those of you wanting to heal your grief, whether it's to get an afterlife connection or not, it's to create a healthy environment around the rest of your life as you process your grief in a spiritually alive way for you in a way that raises your vibration and frequency and in a way that still honors your loved one who passed and your connection to them. Some of the bereaved actually turn to drinking, drugs, gambling, sleeping around, all kinds of different addictions to avoid the pain that they're feeling or to actually feel something when they're feeling so numb from the loss. And I understand that too. But when we start to incorporate unhealthy habits for us as a way to avoid working through our grief, we actually create more problems that damage other areas of our life. So in this program, you're going to learn how to heal the very specific spiritual lessons that you have gained from loving your loved one and losing your loved one. As you progress through grief ease, you'll notice that there are nine spiritual lessons. I have found that people that don't process their grief fully, they may store it in different parts of their life and not fully release it, not fully realize the value of the life that they shared with the person that they loved and the soul journey that they've been on, including all the spiritual lessons, the contracts, the timing of their death by going through their own death door and how these things impact you in your life and how from a higher perspective, you can actually see how beautiful and divine it has actually been for you and how this moves you forward, feeling inspired to take your next action steps and creating a beautiful life and a new life path. This program cannot guarantee that you will have an afterlife visit with your loved one, but it does guarantee to increase your frequency and vibration, which will benefit you in all areas of your life, including opening you to the frequency and vibration of the spirit world. If you're ready to nurture your soul and invest in your own healing, sign up now to get started. This program usually sells for $9.97. With this offer, you could actually sign up to take your sacred solo journey through Grief Ease for only $4.97. This includes nine spiritual lessons plus nine specific assignments to help you ease your grief. Go ahead and sign up and start your sacred solo journey. And at any time, if you decide you'd rather work with me one-on-one -on -one for nine weeks to have nine private sessions with me as we work through the nine spiritual lessons and nine specific assignments, I will apply the full amount of what you've paid for this program towards the program Reconnect. So there's no reason to delay. Go ahead and begin your healing journey today. Let's dive in and begin to ease your grief.